Hi, boys and girls. So now we're going to read a story about Benjamin Franklin. And this is 20 fun facts about Benjamin Franklin. I think we're going to read about 10 because it can get kind of long. So here we go. A man of many talents. When you think of Benjamin Franklin, you probably imagine the same face that appears on a $100 bill. You might picture a funny man in glasses who's crazy enough to fly a kite in a thunderstorm. But there's so much more to Ben. Ben Franklin was one of the most talented men in history. He was a printer, writer, scientist, inventor, and public servant. His ideas and work helped build the United States. Some people even call him the first American. So here's a photo of Ben. Fact number one. Ben Franklin barely went to school. He mostly taught himself. Ben Franklin was born on January 17, 1706 in Boston, Massachusetts. He was the youngest son of a candle maker. He educated himself by reading and studying on his own. Even though he didn't go to college, Harvard and Yale universities granted him degrees to honor him. Fact number two. Ben secretly wrote for his brother, James's newspaper, at a young age. By age 12, Franklin was working at his brother's print shop, and he started writing long pieces called Essay. Here's some photos of him. So we're going to skip to uh, fact four. In 1754, Ben Franklin made his first American political cartoon. It says the Join or Die cartoon was a picture of a cut a snake meant to show readers the American colonies would suffer unless they joined together. So this is a very famous cartoon in our country, and he actually drew it. Let's go ahead and switch to fact six. So one thing that he did, listen for your good citizen, Franklin started the first American library. During the 1700s, few in the colonies had books to read. They had to be shipped from Europe and only very wealthy people could afford them. But in 1731, Ben founded the Library Company of Philadelphia, the first library in America. <clears throat> so that was something that was super important. Here's another cool thing that he did. Ben improved the post office system. The British government made Ben postmaster of Philadelphia and then one of two postmasters of North America. He improved the mail carrying system by adding more routes and making the system faster. So there's two awesome reasons that he was a good citizen. Fact number eight, this is one of the ones he's most famous for. He explained how electricity worked. During the 1700s, electricity was mostly a mystery. Ben's experiments were important early lessons about le electricity and how to use it. So he um, used lots of different experiments like this. And fact number nine goes into one of his most famous experiments. Ben is said to have experimented with lightning using a kite. Ben thought lightning was electricity and wanted to prove it. One story says he flew a kite with a key attached to it on a string. The kite then sent the electrical charge in the air down the string through the key and into a special jar. All right, and here's two other awesome facts about him. Fact 10. He invented his own stove. So the Franklin stove was built to keep in heat and move it around a house more usefully. So here's a picture of the stove he created. Here's another awesome fact. Ben created bifocal glasses. So he invented glasses. Franklin had lots of trouble seeing. He created eyeglasses called bifocals that helped him with different eye problems. The top lens in a bifocal is to see objects far away, and the bottom is to see objects close, like the page of a book. So they look pretty old-timey there. So 
that he came up with the first ones. Let me go ahead and skip for a few. All right, so this is another super important fact. Franklin is the only founding father to sign all three documents that created America. So there are three documents that created the United States. First, the Declaration of Independence. Two, the Treaty of Paris. And three, the U.S. Constitution. And Ben signed them all. All right, then the last one. Ben Franklin lived the American dream. The American dream is that the idea that anyone can be successful if they educate themselves and work hard. He did just that without money or formal education. He was honest, intelligent, and creative. He made the most of his life and kept learning to make his and others' lives better. So I definitely heard some reasons he would be a good citizen in that last page. So go ahead and click on my next video to see how to set up your Google assignment. <clears throat>